everyone, welcome back to Mochi's channel. And today I wanted to make a video on how to teach your dog to jump over things. Dog lovers paradise mochis. So first, in order to teach your dog to jump over things, you're gonna want to get a type of pole. Right here, I'm using the long part of our vacuum cleaner. And you can honestly use anything. And first, you're just gonna lay it onto the ground. You're definitely gonna wanna do this on a carpeted area if you're inside, or ideally you're outside on a grassy area, but definitely don't do this on like a hardwood floor where your dog can slip and hurt himself. And first, you're just gonna lay the um, pole on the floor, as you see here. And you're just gonna encourage your dog to step over it while saying the word jump. So at first your dog might hit into the pole, that's fine. As long as they go directly over the pole, you're gonna click and reward on the other side. One way you can do this is make your dog sit and stay on one side or just stay, you don't have to make them sit on one side and then call them over to the other side. Instead of saying come, you say jump and with the right tone, you'll, your dog will know he wants you to come to them. And you definitely want to position the pool so that there's no way to really get around it. Um, later on in the video, you'll see Mochi figures out that he can just jump onto the couch and get around it, and that's not good. So ideally, you can place the pole between a wall and another obstacle. So the only option for your dog to get from point A to point B is over this pole. Once your dog is get, getting used to that, you're gonna want to elevate the pole very, very little, literally like an inch or three or four inches, but n not more than that. So as you can see here, I just put it on top of two Nike shoe boxes, which are actually very low in height, so barely any jumping. And I'm gonna do the same thing and encourage my dog to jump over by going to the other side or by throwing a treat to the other side. Either one works, whatever your dog is more motivated by. And as soon as they jump over or clear that pole, you're gonna click and give them a treat. If they hit into the pole and knock it over, you definitely don't want to penalize them because that's probably gonna be a bit scary for them with the noise of the pole falling down, whatever. And also you wanna make sure that the pole can easily fall if your dog hits into it. For example, you don't want your dog's back paws to get caught on this pole and then he falls to the ground instead of the pole just getting knocked off. It's actually really dangerous if you have a super rigid pole. Once your dog is consistently clearing this very, very low level, then you're gonna to wanna to raise it a little bit more again. Here I'm just using a few of my piano sheet music books, raising it by like two inches at a time. And again, repeat the process. Now, once you get to a level high enough, your dog might try to crawl under the, the pole. And then you have two options there. One option is to bring it back down again until your dog really, really solidifies that the command jump means to jump, you know? And that's why we're doing this command jump when we do this, we're not just saying come. Or if no matter how many times you bring it down, he still is trying to go under when you bring it back up, try to put an obstacle underneath. Not something wide that your dog has to jump like that over, but you know, maybe if you have another pole, you can put it under that. Just a way to indicate to your dog visually that he should not go under and go over. And yeah, and you just keep doing that. And now your dog should know how to jump. Um, this is a very easy process, but not one that you can just do one day, you know? It might take a few days or weeks to perfect it until your dog can regularly jump over a normal height agility bar, for example. Always keep it safe, always keep it fun. I hope this video helps and I hope your dog can jump around um, <laughs> with fun and we'll see you next time. Bye.